Greetings Google Academy UK and in this quick video we're going to be increasing max file upload size via SSH and we'll start off with copy this command and then we're going to open the terminal which is here I'll show you open the correct one, I opened the wrong one earlier that'll take a little moment so I'll just take it through what let's have a look here so at the moment we've done a few Updates, nothing major to the site itself, just things in the back end like the padlock and you know stuff like that. So let's see if this runs up and see if that's open now. Ah, look at that. You don't get that very often, do you? How many times do you see this on web dev on a brand new install? But sometimes the Lord just smiles down on us, mate. I bet Google's loving me really. Right, let's come back over here a moment. Then we're going to enter as this here fella, so do I. So we can see now we're in root, yeah. And what I'll do is I'll arrange my window a bit better at the moment. I didn't expect that 100 to be honest with you, it sort of throwed me a bit, but you know, in a sort of happy way. So let's see. So if you follow these lessons all the way through to stage 8, you see they'll take you up to uh, 100 for all four. Pretty much unheard of. Go check many other websites like you know, set up wherever you go set up with. Set up your basic WordPress with SiteGround, WP Engine, Blue Score, Daddy, whatever, and let's see what happens. Yep, you're probably not going to get that sort of score. Right now, I want to enter into here. Look. And then press enter. Okay. Control W at the top up here, look the keyboards there. Yeah. Then we're going to search for this. Put this in here, see it flashing. Hit enter. We can see it's there, uh, look, it's got to the end of it, see it flashing up here. Right, so what we can do is with this first, we have to navigate with your cursor keys, remember. So we're going to change this spot in Megan, and I'm going to put mine up to what did I say? I think 256, weren't it? Well, why not anyway? 256 meg. Yeah. Press enter. Cursor will give you a start line. You require you to write a key to navigate to 40 meg. We've done that bit. Change it to that. I've changed mine to 128. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to stay true to form for this purpose. And then. Restart patch with a change to take effect. So hang on, what else we got to do then? Right, so I think I've missed a step there to tell people. Let's see. Right, so if it's Control X on here, I believe, then we may be asked, do we want to save changes? Hit yes and enter. There you go, that's lovely. Right, now we're going to restart a patch here. And all should be well with the world. Let's see. All right, so we see it started as a new command and everything. Refresh this page to make sure we've still got a working website. Yes, we have. I knew mean, well, that's the wrong one. Dimbat, Dingwit, you know, whatever. Right, let's see, actually. Refresh this website and see if we have a working one. We can so you see, you know, to so, uh, <laughs> show you clients like, hey, Look at my website. It's like well called high scoring website in the world. What's your website do? Well, we do that. <laughs> Not a lot more. Oh, hang on. We could go to the top of the page as well if we've got any text. We've got a WordPress link. But let's see what else. Is there anything else we want to do while we're in there? Come on. Right. More tweaks. Right. Memory limit. So let's have a look at these and do these while we're here, shall we? What do you reckon? Right, so we need to copy this one again, look. Then because we're still in as root. Press that, open up as config again. Then we need to do the keyboard up here, look. Control W. Then we can... We've done that anyway. Post max size. We did that with the WP config. So let's look at max execution time and see if this is... Wow. Let's see what we've got here. Execution time. 
I don't think it even show it. Oh, not found. Max execution time not found. So let's not worry about that. We've covered that post max size. We've increased memory limit, and we've seen the test through re-downloading the WP config. And that's it. We're in five minutes. We've done all that. I'm just going to close that. I don't need that anymore. Leave. Make sure we do slobber website. There you go. Happy days. Um. There you go. When you get up to step eight and you've done all these things, you get all best practices into place. We've got a couple of things here. <coughs> that need looking at but as you can see even though the impact is high and medium it's not impacting here whatsoever so as always if you've got any questions or comments or feedback or if you even know a better way to do it by all means leave a comment and i'll get back to you as soon as possible and as always stay safe regards from ramsgate united kingdom